Hi guys and welcome to JavaScript Playground. Let's start with what is JavaScript. JavaScript is a lightweight cross-platform object-oriented programming language. Let's see what this statement means. Lightweight means that it doesn't take a lot of memory to run the code. Cross-platform means that it can be run on different platforms and object-oriented means that it is based on object-oriented programming concepts. Don't worry if you don't understand these points right now, we will be exploring these concepts throughout the course. Together with HTML and CSS, JavaScript is one of the three core web development technologies. HTML is used to show content on a web page. CSS is used to add styles to that content and handling the layout. In other words, it handles the presentation. JavaScript is used to add interactivity and dynamic effects to that content. It can be used to manipulate HTML and CSS. For example, showing a pop-up on a button click or showing page progress on scroll, etc., etc. Well, JavaScript is a great language to learn today because JavaScript is what made modern web development possible. As I just mentioned, it adds the dynamic effects and interactivity to these modern websites. Even the major web applications like Facebook, Netflix, Instagram are running JavaScript frameworks and libraries under the hood. The most famous modern web development frameworks and libraries are written on top of JavaScript. For front-end, you have React.js, Angular, Ember.js, Vue.js, and many more. And for backend, you have Node.js, Meteor.js, Backbone.js, etc. Whether you want to be a front-end web developer or a back-end developer, JavaScript is where you can start. Now that being said, let's see how we are going to take it ahead from here. We'll be starting right from the basics like data type, program structure, objects, and we will move towards more advanced topics like DOM manipulation, connecting with backend, etc to build a strong understanding of the language. Also, I believe that understanding and getting comfortable with JavaScript is by doing a lot of hands-on practice. So there are many surprises awaiting you. We will do practice problems after every new concept, a mini project at the end of every module, and at the end of the course, we will do a major project. I hope you're excited because I just cannot wait. See you in the next video. Bye and take care.